I'm so freaked out about what you're going to do to me next. The birthday surprises just keep on coming for Jennifer Garner when she visits the Drew Barrymore show on April 17th. And one special honor brings her to tears. At first, the actress thinks this is just going to be a regular old chat with her buddy Drew. But think again. Not only is there the most special person here, but it's a very special day. It's your birthday! <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, you guys. And thank you, Drew, you little peanut. Thanks. <laughs> like that. I, I want to be your I little mean, peanut. I 51. Let's get a change of birthday scenery around our Hit it! <laughs> We were just whispering at each other, so she goes, you're bananas. I was like, I certainly am. Now that the party has started, Drew reveals a very big surprise from Charleston, West Virginia, Jennifer's hometown, and it's getting everyone misty-eyed, especially the birthday girl. From here on out, April 17th will be known as Jennifer Garner Day in Charleston. <laughs> Jennifer, it is with great pleasure to honor you for your commitment to the arts, your passion for West Virginia, your generous and giving spirit. We're honoring you with the key to the city. Jennifer also opens up about her work with Save the Children, which helps underprivileged kids in the U.S. and around the world. Garner is a huge supporter of the organization, and Drew has another surprise in honor of Jen's B-Day. As another birthday gift, we got together with our friends at Spin Master, and they're actually donating $25,000 uh, to their local Save the Children organization. Thank you so much. Thank you. these actual play kits and um, there are going to be 500 of them and they're all filled with toys such as wow. Rubik's Cubes and Etch-a-Sketches oh and they want to help bring the joy to the children all around the globe for a total um, donation of over $200,000 in honor of you for Save the Children. Drew is the gift that just keeps on giving. But when she asks the newly 51-year-old her advice for starting the day off right, the talk show host goes from party time to officially pooped. Well, what I do in the morning is I work out. Okay. <laughs> Every day? Every day. Oh, God. Pretty much. No, Drew, really. You just, it's like, you just need, you've got to do hard cardio to get that to get yourself, I'm sorry, you do. I'm sorry, you do. It, no, we need it in our bodies, we need it, but we need it in our brains. Your brain needs it. How long? <laughs> <laughs> you find something that actually makes you feel joyful while you're doing it, or it won't work, because this is not gonna get her done. <laughs> Okay, that's good. That's okay. All right, then I'm gonna do it in the morning in honor of you. I'm gonna start, and I, I've gotta be <laughs> consistent with it. Way to commit, Barrymore. But if the choice is between cardio or cake, we'll go with cake. <laughs>